The mushroom said to me once, uh, nature loves courage. Nature loves courage. And I said, what's the payoff on that? And it said, it shows you that it loves courage because it will remove obstacles. You make the commitment and nature will respond to that commitment by removing impossible obstacles. Dream the impossible dream and the world will not grind you under. It will lift you up. This is the trick. This is what all these uh, uh, teachers and philosophers who really counted, who really touched the alchemical gold, this is what they understood. This is the shamanic dance in the waterfall. This is how magic is done. It's done by hurling yourself into the abyss and discovering that it's a feather bed. And there's no other way to do it. Uh, this is why I have always taken the position that as modern people, you know, we can't go out and uh, set armies marching or launch religions and who would want to anyhow. But to the people who say adventure has fled, it's all humdrum. I just know, you know, that they have forgotten the five grams of psilocybin sitting in their refrigerator. <laughs> I mean, Magellan may have had excitement rounding the horn, but you in your living room later tonight can put him in the shade if you have the courage to do the things that are necessary to do. And we know what they are. And of course, the first thing to do is to tell society to fuck off because they don't know what's going on.